Morning. It's uh, Wednesday, March 14th, 2012. Um, I'm going to work on the uh, storage unit to try to clear enough spot to um, bring in the pickup truck so that I can do the uh, throw bearing job. I'm also going to take a look at the Jeep um, and see what's involved with getting that running. And also I'm going to uh, be working on the processing unit to try to get that clear enough to bring the Blazer and the Jeep into that unit. I'll have to register the uh, um, trailer that's in it. Um, I'm not sure how much that'll cost. I already have the titling uh, junk done with that it's homemade trailer. Uh, so I'll have to get the, some plates for that somehow. I'm not going to do that today, I don't think. And that's the plan for today. So. Along those lines. Yeah, I hope I have room for this. this is my video camera, GPS, and uh, tire pump. Video camera is actually obsolete, but it's actually better quality than this one in case they want to make any movies or anything. <sighs> Plus, if I ever find any of my old movies, I can uh, convert them with that. Anyway, looking for the keys for my toolbox. Yeah, it's getting pretty tight, but I could fit some more stuff in here yet. I have some stuff out that I was working on cars with. So another thing I got to do today is fix up that uh, SK set that I broke the sockets on on that Honda job. And uh, I want to try to get that red table down here. Because I can use that for uh, YouTube processing, which means i got to pull this out. I don't know where he wants to put it. I'm going to have to get one of these little pie plate things. I think that's a 10 inch hole. And seal that up. Alright, this should be interesting. I'm going to start by digging out that red table and that, uh, and that, um, shelf. It's got to go to the house. I have to find a place for all this crap. Some of this is going to the house. Some of it's getting packed in the uh, <clears throat> time castle unit. Okay, what I'm going to do is convert this trailer <clears throat> into a time capsule for Kaya. Uh, we're going to put all Kaya's components in here. They should all fit easily, and then there'll be room for something else later. But I think <laughs> Kaya's got a lot of components. And the house electric's about to go off. Been arguing with George. He doesn't want to call him, and he doesn't want to get all his statements in order so he can win a fight with him. Or you don't want to do anything, so it's going to get shut off in a couple days. <clears throat> so I'm going to have to prioritize a generator and uh, build some kind of a um, charcoal grill or something in the backyard so I can cook with. I'm going to have to stop buying refrigeratable crap. <sighs> I'm going to put. Yeah, I don't think I'm even going to fit all the cabinets in here. There's one more cabinet here. I want the other cabinet upstairs in my house. I don't know how far that might that might disassemble. I gotta start taking all that down in my computer desk. I'll put everything in here for Kaya. Maybe get down to like a laptop so I'm mobile for a while. Because I need to generate some cash flow. This one wouldn't fit because of the lip. I had to pull this one back out again and put this one in. It's really sad. I'm damaging the paint like mad. I'm trying to get this because it's all metal. It's dragging on the metal. I can't lift the whole thing by myself. 
I had to repaint this thing. This one always needed paint. <clears throat> That's the only big stuff. These two and then the two big units in my apartment you've seen on the other videos. That's it. So I should be able to fit everything in here. <clears throat> All the rest is little stuff I can stuff in there. Yeah, nice. I hope that's nice. I can theoretically, I don't know how big the other cabinet is at the house. I theoretically slide it on top of one of these two somehow. I don't know. I hope it comes apart. I don't know. I gotta start taking that apart. So actually, I should put that other cabinet at my desk in here before uh, putting the rest of Kaya's crap in here. I put a fender protector on here to try to keep it from scratching, but I don't know if it's gonna do any good. Well, now to dig out this red table and that uh, shelf and bring that down to George's. I don't know what size um, wood base I need to build for the second knock box. I dug it out. There's a lot more in this garage than I thought there was. Mostly mechanical crap. I'm going to put these projects together then I won't need half of it. Um, I'm going to pull this table out and reposition the truck and uh, load the table. And I have to unload the uh, sprint hood at the sprint garage first. I'll load the table, the Jeep hood, which I'm going to be working on at night. And um, this um, shelf. Right into George's house. This is why I designed this hitch to come so far out. How far I can jackknife this truck. I could jackknife it more. It almost jacked that trailer, jackknifed that trailer 90 degrees on this truck. Arg, I can't even fit the sprint head in here. I'm going to have to move some stuff around over here to slide that hood in. There we have it, one sprint hood. Well, they got in here now is the ladder, so I can easily fit that uh, table and um, shelf. Then I'll shoot back and empty it. I'm gonna have to dig out the drawer for this. This is a tough old army table. I think I painted it red. I don't remember if it was painted red or not. All steel. It's a beautiful work table. It's fun to work with this. Anyway, I get rid of some of these tires. A couple of these are probably still good. I don't think those are really that good. No, nah, those won't even pass. There's my drawer. Of course, it's buried. I'll go dig that out. Yeah, that's nice. If they ever converted this into a construction truck, that would be cool. I'd put that in the front. For, uh, yeah. yeah, I'm going to bring this compressor and this uh, stainless cleaning tank over to George's as well. I'm going to have to make a pad for that too. I'm going to make a concrete pad or I'll, I'll make another one out of wood. Should bring a deep freeze, but uh, it wouldn't behoove me have a deep freeze at George's house because everything would just be vanishing. So I guess I'll just sell that. <clears throat> I'll dig that out. I'll sell that up on uh, Craigslist or something. I got a washing machine which isn't really in that good of shape. I'll sell that too. It's mechanically good. I should put it upstairs actually so, I, so that my uh, clothes stop getting filled full of mysterious holes. They demolished the house across the street, you know. Notice that? Yeah, no. I mean, We're going to have a bigger junkyard across the street now. Brenda should be happy. Yeah. <laughs> she, she loves that junkyard. Anyway, I'm taking George to get some cigarettes.
He's been busy with yard work. Waiting for George outside United Bank again. I don't know what kind of issues he's having with this bank. Okay, we cleaned out an area for the table. That doesn't sound plastic. like plastic, that sounds like it glass. It feels like plastic, but here. It's crystal, George, I yeah. can hear it. It's good right, glass. It, it feels like plastic. You understand? When you feel it, until you... Yeah. Because it's heavy. Well, These are dessert glasses. <laughs> we'll put them up on eBay if you want to make money. Hopefully, they're not any of them broken. We're gonna no, have to make a we're gonna, we're gonna have to make a path around this because I'm gonna build a deck just like what's under this knack box here for the other knack box. See? This yeah, that's that's good. That's like a restaurant quality glass. Yeah, that's for cordials. Yeah. There's whiskey glasses. Yeah, you should sell those up on eBay. Looks like you got a whole set of dishes in there too. Yeah. Anyway, I'm gonna put the uh, red table right in front of the fireplace. Later we'll pull the fireplace out and seal it. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to clear a path there, George, for after I get that yeah. base on there. We'll know where it is after I build the base. I don't know if I have enough wood unless I take apart the motorcycle ramp. Then I need well, new I'm motorcycle gonna ramp. I'm gonna move stuff out of the way here, take that table apart, then there's a little more room in this little square area. Yeah. Then we'll have a nice little processing area we can run some crap to, yeah. to eBay and do some mechanical crap too, you know? Yeah. If we clear more, we got tools, George. You know, we'll, we'll make, we'll make some the stuff. Table. You got no, the drill the press. The I got another side. drill press up in Pennsylvania. Yeah, they're not plastic. That's that's crystal. Yeah. I think yeah. I know they. Are. Well, I don't know. Maybe uh, some of them are plastic. No, they feel like plastic. Is what I'm saying. But they're crystal. Yeah, those are good, look like restaurant dishes, George. Yeah. Yeah, restaurant yeah, coffee cups. Were they from Franklin Street? They no, these are. This is from Dicky. This uh, is. This is those, uh, huh. what the fuck do you call it? The same stuff I have upstairs, you see? I should bring that laundry thing and we could put a little tub here so we can wash crap down here. But put these are, pump. I forgot the name of them, but these are, you know, they don't have them anymore. These are, uh, I forgot what they call them. Um, some kind of Dutch thing, Delphi Blue or something. No, no, the name of it. Yeah, Delphi. Canterbury or something like that. Or it probably says on the bottom. No. Comes in, comes in a certain set. Well, they definitely. I got stuff <laughs> up the stairs. They definitely need to be cleaned and repacked because this is just. I got stuff that's on the stairs. Crazy. And not having tunnels through this is hindering the operations. Alright, the beginnings of a nice little workshop here. Yeah. We'll get that shelving unit. I'm putting the shelving unit on, it's too high. So I have to think what I'm going to do with that shelving unit. I can't use it there. Maybe I'll just paint it here and bring it upstairs. Oh, I just got the mail. It's kind of a little late to uh, be working on storage units. 